You guys are probably like, oh my god, Cage's gonna fall. Oh, Cage's gonna fall. Oh my god. Uh. What's up, Zombie Slayers? This is KG48, and welcome back to my 7 Days to Die Let's Play. Today, we're going to be doing Vanilla. It is really early in the morning, and I just woke up, so my voice might sound a little weird. My intro's off. It's all good. We're here in the Dijon Tower, and we're going to continue going along in this place. A lot of you guys did not understand what I said last video. <laughs> a lot of you guys in the comments were like, what? This you, You've never... You know, I just imagine you sitting there going... Blah, blah, blah. You'd never done Dijon Tower? Yes, guys, that is what I said. I've never done this tower before. First time. So we're going to continue along here during the night. Um, I went ahead and put a bunch of stuff in a drop-off chest here. I marked the drop-off chest with a number one, which means that, like, as I go up, there's going to be multiple drop-off chests in this tower. And as I go up, I'll, you know... Actually, you can't edit this, can you? Well, whatever, I'll just replace it. And I'll do DC2, DC3, depending on how many drop-off chests we have in here. And I will be going through the night because I ain't afraid of no zombies. So, if you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Alright. Alright, so I don't have any... Uh, I, I apparently don't have... Oh... Okay, I already have that. Um, I apparently I do not have any night vision, which is a little, little disappointing. I thought I might have night vision, but I think where I thought I had night vision was actually um, in another game. Um, I think I have night vision in War of the Walkers. So, close that so we don't, we don't get interrupted here with our zombie remains. Um, I'm not looting that stuff. Uh, I'm going to be a little bit careful of what I loot here. I'm not going to loot everything, you know. I like to loot stuff that's important to me, and maybe I'll loot stuff here and there, but, uh, you know, these cabinets, like, you know, <laughs> it's just like, eh, why bother, you know? Um, I know it's because it gets my scavenging skill up, but at this point in the Let's Play, I think I'd rather just put points in a scavenging skill. I know it seems like a waste, but, um, you know, it's a waste of my time is looting 50 cabinets in a Dijon building. That's, that just drives me up a wall, you know? Uh, and I've been doing a lot of looting in my other videos, and in the modded series, the, the looting is, is way more fun, way more interesting. Um, so... Yeah, uh, so if you see me skip some cabinets here or there, you know why. All right. what, am I taking... Was I always doing the uh, faucets in this run? I think I was, right? Yeah, look at all that brass. Yeah, we're going to continue with the faucets. Hells to the F and yeah. We need that brass, man. Um, World Ender is... World Ender. I really wish you could name your guns. World Ender here is thirsty. All right, she's thirsty. And she likes to, she likes to feed on slugs. So we need we we're gonna need a lot of man. That's that is that works out pretty well. World Ender is thirsty. She feeds on slugs. Yeah, that's that's cool. I like that. All right. So I said I wasn't gonna loot. I, you know, hey, sometimes I'll loot the sometimes I'll loot the toilet. Sometimes I won't. I'm a I'm a complicated guy. There's a lot of things going through my mind, and you know, um, honestly, I don't know what's going through my mind half the time. So what are you gonna do? Right, scrap all that. Scrap that. Repair. Oh, can't do anything else. Okay. All right, so we got some rooms that go around in a circle here, which is nice. Did I loot this room already? I guess I did. I guess I done looted that room. Well, let's come over here. I don't think... Did we loot everything over here yet? Uh, nope. Uh, we will repair... that. Nah, won't repair that just yet. We'll scrap that. I think I put all my leather away or something, so... And cloth. I should probably hold leather and cloth on me at all times uh, for repairs. There we go. Now we care. What's the repair button? It's A, right? Okay, I gotta try and remember that. I like to use the hotkeys. They definitely make things go faster. So. Okay, take that. Uh, scrap, scrap. No, oh, God, forget it. <laughs> oh, boy. Sit down, chump. Oh! No, 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 not you, chump. Oh, my God, what is this? What is this madness? Ooh, that was, that was a little exciting there. What's going on? I'm not even sure what's going on in this freaking place. Oh, boy. Okay, well, we lived. Lots of dead businessmen. There we go. There we go. I'll take that money. Thank you. Gotta make a trip to the trader. That's what we have to do when we get out of here. I don't know how many days this thing's gonna take me, but when we get out of here, we're gonna make a trip to the trader. Oh my god. I need more scrapping uh, areas. Like in, like in all the mods I play, we get extra scrapping spots. And that's what I need now, because I want to scrap the hell out of stuff. 
Um, oh my god, so many clothes. There's, there's my baby right there. The slugs. Oh, I'm hungry. I'm hungry for slugs. Thirsty. No, I like thirsty. I'm thirsty. Must have slugs. It's saying thirsty for slugs, but I, I think of a slug as a, um, as a solid food. But that's okay. I mean, we're talking about a, a shotgun wanting to drink slugs. I don't think it really has to make much sense. <laughs> Whatever sounds cooler. And thirsty sounds cooler than hungry. So, there's that. Okay, so let's go that way. So, we're going to ignore that for now. Um, we're going to go back into that. And, and uh, We're going to go back over here and see what we got over here. Because... Um... Oh, okay, so it just goes on the other side. Okay. I see. Oh, okay. So we didn't even have to go through all that stuff. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. I wonder if that hole was supposed to be there if a zombie broke it out. Honestly, it looks like a zombie broke that out. I don't think that... Yeah, because there's no door... Well, yeah, there's no door frame. I don't think the door frame stays there. I don't know if that's a door or not. I don't think it is. I don't think it is. All right, let's scrap and repair and repair and scrap... And we're going to hold on to the money. Scrap that. Can't do anything. All right. We're just going to throw this stuff back in there. Stuff I want to scrap, I'm going to keep on me. Stuff I'm not going to scrap is going to go away like that and that. And that looks pretty good. Okay. Let's keep going. Um, known. Scrap. 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 There we go. Now we're getting some scrapping done, people. It's all about the scrapping. Okay, so let's get to the next part of this. Oops. Oh, really, Cage? What the frig? There we go. <laughs> Real problems there. All right, this uh, place seems a little badass, so I'm going to take another set of pills. Yeah, yeah, you're thirsty. Shut up. All right. Oh, boy, look at that. Okay. There we go. All righty. I got my shotgun all loaded, just in case. Ooh, I don't like the looks of this. Um, beware. Okay, yeah, I really don't like the looks of this. <sighs> um, <laughs> what do you think? Just go for it. Okay, cool. Oh man, this place reminds me of Die Hard. Remember, like that building was like in construction. Ooh, nice. Me likey, and I can put all those together, too. Um, assemble... We will assemble the sawed-off shotgun since it's got... Since we have the sawed-off barrel. Oh, wait. That's right. The stock can't go in the sawed-off shotgun. Okay. Then we will, um... We'll go back, and we'll do the pump shotgun. Because the pump shotgun is better. Sorry about that. We're gonna have some weird cuts today. Because, like I said, I just got up a little while ago. My voice isn't really there yet, and... I got allergies and all kinds of problems. Come on, dick. What's your what's your malfunction, bro? I'm gonna cut your gizzards out. What do you think about that? Hey, like me now. Uh, yep, that's better. Scrap, scrap. You know what? I'm just gonna scrap this stupid shotgun barrel. I don't like the short shotgun, period. I know a lot of people like to sell me on it. I mean, it's okay if you don't have any shotgun, but... So where does this place fall out? This is a really interesting building. I'm kind of sad I haven't done it before. I'm, I'm wondering where the where the floor is going to fall, you know? Oh, there we go. Uh, right here. Assemble. Okay. Alright. You guys are probably like, Oh my god, Cage is going to fall. Oh, Cage is going to fall. Oh my god. Uh... Ooh, where'd they come from? Was that door? Was there a door there? <laughs> I guess there was no door there, man, because they came out. Oh, boy. They came out fast. Alrighty. You know what? Let's keep the pills here. Oh, boy. Can zombies set off, uh, like, fall away floors? Because I might be able to use the zombie. Like, I guess the zombie ran across there, so that should not be a fallaway floor, right? Now, the shotgun is calling in more zombies. I get that. But, you know, I, I need to get them dead. 
Oh boy. I don't know why I, I don't know why I underestimated this place. Um, I should have known this place would be tough at night. I don't. I just came in here like, yeah, no big deal. It's like I don't even have a lot of armor on. Look at this. I've got no leg armor. Um. Okay, so just no leg armor. But and my other armor isn't that good. So yeah, I should be a little bit more careful in here. Okay. At least I don't have to worry about the messy buff. I had a dream last night. Um. <laughs> that I was playing Seven Days to Die and I got the messy buff. Like, that's it. I was I was playing Seven Days to Die, Ravenhurst mod, and I got the messy buff. That was my dream. This is what I think about when I go to sleep. N not really. Actually, I wasn't even thinking about it. I don't know why, um, why I got that messy buff. All right. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, fair enough. Wait, didn't I see a... I could... Hmm. Okay, whatever. I could have sw swear I saw a couple of safes around here. But I don't know. Maybe that was another hallway. Come on, punk. Come on, punk. Where is he? I think these walls are super, uh, super weak. Man, what? How did you not hear that? Yeah, I think the idea is that every the walls in here are super weak. So the zombies can get through them easier. That might be why that zombie got on me so fast. Or maybe there was no door there. I don't know. I didn't see. Alright. Uh, I guess let's loot. I hear a zombie trying to jump somewhere. Oh, paint. I have to paint my... I have to paint uh, Bloodbath and Beyond at some point. That and let's get some more drink. We're gonna run out of drink eventually if we keep using these pills. I really liked. I w normally, if I was playing here and I wasn't recording, I would just go silent, turn off the headlight, and just be really quiet. But um, in the interest of making a video that people can see and not playing in utter darkness, um, I'm not gonna do that. Sound like that might have been above me. Is there something below these things or No, that's that's just painted. That's not even metal. That's just that's just painted. Okay. Alright. I'm not seeing a lot of loot yet, but at the same time, we're very early in this, uh, we're very early in this, um, building, so. I'm actually gonna break that up. Okay, let's head back, and, nah, let's just keep going this way, I guess. Getting a little turned around in here. Oh, here we go, this is the main room, okay. Is it? It's the other side of the room, that's what it is. This is where the zombie came from. And this is where I came from. Okay. Alright, well, let's just keep going. Okay, so we got that. We got, we we're in there. That's fine. That goes into the other room we were already in. This is a weird room. Why would they have put a room here at nothing? I don't know. I'm going to check this out. I'm curious. No. I don't know. Why would they paint that something different? Let's just break this out. I'm just curious. Why Why would they ever put nothing in it and one tile, one roof tile that looks different? Okay. Okay. That's either a way you could fall down or that's a secret room up there.
No, this isn't. This doesn't look like a secret room. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna come back down here. When I come up here, if I don't get into that room, I'll come back down here and come back up through that room. I don't think it's a secret room. I don't know what is with that room though. It's kind of weird. All right, so we came from over here, so we gotta go this way. I don't really need the oil barrels that badly. I'm picking them up because I'm afraid if I get in a fight with some zombies, uh, we could have some boom booms, and that might not be a good a, a good idea. All right, so this is going through to another part of the uh, another part. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna travel back around to where I came from and see if there's anything um, I missed over there because I feel like there was mo oh cool it's daytime I feel like there was multiple ways to go over here and I just kind of came through and didn't and missed a lot of stuff. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. So that's where it is. Okay, is it over here too. Yep, it's a big fall away floor. Yep. Okay, so this is where I came through. Okay, so all right, so these are locked doors. Okay, so this is unlocked. Okay, another another ceiling with nothing. Weird. There's a dead zombie in here? I, I wasn't in here. That's weird. Pretty sure I wasn't in here. Alright, well, it is what it is. Um, oh boy, how do we get through this? Uh, stay on the outside? Yeah, stay on the outside. Yeah, look at me, man. I'm freaking ninja. Hardcore parkour. That was awesome. Okay, well, let's keep going through then. Glad it's daytime. Really, really glad it's daytime. Yeah, I think this is the other side. Okay. Alright, I'm not really afraid anymore now that it's daytime. What do we got here? I'm not even looting that stupid crap anymore. I, you know, I gotta tell you, I love you, fun pimps, but opening up these crates and getting stupid crap like couches and stuff is really really annoying it's just like like if i if i knew there was a couch or if i knew there was a the bottom of a fridge i wouldn't have bothered and i feel like it's like forcing us to waste time um i get why you do it you probably want to like make the make the make these things take longer i get it but god i don't like it <laughs> all right let's come through here anything in there doesn't look like it nope 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 okay Okay, coming through here. Yeah, so far this place has been a little disappointing, but again, um, it's a it's the biggest it's the biggest skyscraper, which is kind of weird why I didn't do it. Um, so there's going to be a lot to it. So hey, that rhymes. All right. Okay, I should be. I guess I could leave the garbage. You're not in the garbage. Okay. So it looks like we're going up to the next part. Okay, well that's easy enough. Oh boy, look at this. Wow. Are we supposed to climb up here? I think we might supposed to be climbing up. No, you can't get up there without placing stuff. So I don't think you're supposed to climb up there. Maybe, maybe, but it doesn't matter because we've got a whole floor here to loot. Wake up, scum. Sit down, scum. Scum. Why scum? I don't know. Where did I come up with that? I call him scum. <laughs> Alright. Shotgun barrel. You're gonna die. Again. You're gonna double die. I don't need blueberry seeds. At least not right now. Uh, scrap those. Take the jar. I guess. I don't freaking need jars. What the hell am I taking jars for? Uh, I don't know. That's a good question. Okay. Come through here. Go up there. This looks exactly like the place where I started, except for the... This looks like it. Oh, it might be the... No, I don't know. It might be the other side. I'm not sure. What do we got? What do we got? Now, destroyed generators are worth looting, because you sometimes get a lot of iron out of them. Wake up, fool. Oh, look at that. What am I? Level 73? How am I? No, I'm level 108. I was going to say. <laughs> How am I level 73? All right, let's look at some of this stuff. Um, it, there's nothing I really need anymore. Um, so, with that being said, uh, is there really anything I don't need anymore? I need to go with another knife guy, I guess. Uh, construction. No, 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 no. Range traps. Um, I'm not going to use the auto turret. All this, all this stuff is already maxed. 
Um, minus 69er I'm not going to do because I don't really need it. Uh, good guns. I could probably save it for gun. I don't really need a lot. Of, I don't need my guns to be awesome, though. It's quality. Should I put points into scavenging a quality Joe to three? I think, I, honestly, guys, the only other thing I could save my points for is toolsmithing, weaponsmithing. Um, yeah, I mean, that's not even... No, you know what? No, I'm going to... No, 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 no. This is what I'm going to do. Scavenging the 60. Let's do this. I'm against this usually, but we're far enough in the let's play. I don't think it's going to hurt us. There we go. Although we just did spend all of our points. I forgot Quality Joe costs so much, but that's okay. All right. So now we don't have to worry about anything except for gun skills. And, you know, to be perfectly honest, I really probably won't put any more points in a weapon or toolsmithing. I mean, I don't really... Eh, I don't really see a need for it, to be honest. So... All right, let's get let's get this sucker. Oh, blue shovel. And um, I will scrap it. Because it's only iron, and iron is garbage. Oh, wow, a working cement mixer. Okay. A fridge bottom. I think we've already covered how I feel about that. Uh, so that's locked. So we must have to go through here, right? Oh, that's not going to be locked for long. These guys do a lot of damage to the doors, man. Like, they go through them really fast. Like, way faster than in, the, like, the beginning of the game. Remember you, like, remember the beginning when you're, like, first looting houses and the zombies take forever to break through the doors? Now they just go through them like butter. Oh, that's where I, that's where I broke up from the floor. Okay. So, yeah, that, 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 that empty room had absolutely zero purpose. Weird. I wonder if I'm missing loot or something, because this place does not seem to have a lot of loot. I mean... Oh, here we go. Here we go. Lots of fridge bottoms and toilets in here. <laughs> Come on, man. Give me some good stuff. For freak's sake. I'm not looting them. I'm not looting them on protest. I don't care. Nope, I don't care. I'm not doing anything with cardboard boxes. And those. There we go. Working stuff. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, I think we're going to have to go out outside like in the Matrix. This is going to be awesome. Hello, Mr. Anderson. Don't go out there on that ledge. <laughs> okay. I like it. I like it a lot. So much imagination went into these went into these high rises. You know, this has been my favorite game for a long, long time. And, you know, there's lots of things I love about it. Lots of things I uh, think could be improved. But I got to tell you right now, um, these skyscrapers are maybe the most imaginative thinking outside the box um i don't know how, i don't know what other adjectives he used for it um just imaginative i mean just incredibly imaginative i think we're supposed to break into there aren't we i don't see another way in yeah let's break into there it might be something good yeah just ima uh, just imaginative um incredible though like like i've never seen these kind of dungeon crawls in a like a survival game like this you know Oh boy, there's a lot of zombies in there. What is this? Looks like you get hammered on those spikes, huh? Haha, <laughs> you stupid zombie bitch. What? What's with the bitch? Die, bitch? What? What? Man, Mo, was that you? Was this your contribution? So is there anything in here or is it just a, oh, oh, I see. It's supposed to be a fall away thing where you come down here and it says die bitch and there's a bunch of zombies. Okay, got it. So there's probably not any loot in there. There's some loot on the ground there, but I don't, I don't feel like getting it. All right. That's interesting. Yeah, it's just a, it's just a, it's just there's somewhere on the next story where they're going to try and get you to fall through and it's like a pit of death with a bunch of zombies. All right. Fair enough. Let's go. Oh boy. Okay, guys. Well. 
You heard the timer, guys. Um, we are going to call from here. I don't, am I going to be able to finish this next video? Is this going to be like a four video thing? I might have to start going a little faster through it. It's hard, though, when you've never been in, in the building before, you know? Um, you're just trying not to fall through stuff. Uh, so far, after two videos of looting it, eh, the bottom parts, I'm a little bit disappointed with the loot. I don't think they're that good. But... We still have probably like half the building to go through, maybe maybe a third. So I can't wait to do that. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, take it easy.